We are told that if sine x equals a over b, what is sine 90 minus x? Recall that sine 90 minus x is same as cos x because sine and cosine are complementary because of the complementary nature of sine and cosine that is why we have sine 30 equal cos 60 and sine 60 equals cos 30 and so cos x will be since sine x is a over b remember that this theta this angle sine is opposite over hypotenuse to look for what this is let's call it c c from pythagoras theorem is simply b square minus a square and so c is square root of b square minus a square and so and you know that cos s is usually adjacent over hypotenuse which is c over b so that cos x will be square root of b square minus a square over b that is what sine 90 minus s is since it's cos s till we meet again keep enjoying maths bye <music>